The Tox Ulfot has fallen into the hands of the Tholians. Our intelligence indicates increased Tholian activity in the Nakul system. Caldano believes they're trying to interfere with the Nakul in the present because of actions they will take in the future. Caldano has asked you to rendezvous with him in the Nakul system. responding to my message so quickly. The Tholians have the quantum phase inhibitor. I've tracked their ship to this system, and I'm detecting some telltale quantum fluctuations within the star. They're trying to use the device. We need to stop them and recover the device. First, however, we need to help the Nakul. At this point in their history, they're not prepared to repel a Tholian attack. Unidentified vessel, you have entered our space without authorization. If you are an ally of the Tholians, leave now. We have done nothing to provoke their attacks, but we will defend ourselves. Thank you. My people have few warships. Any assistance you could provide against the Tholians would be appreciated. Stop the Tholians before they shut down the star's fusion. The lead Tholian ship has the quantum phase inhibitor. They're going to use it on the star. We have to stop them, board that vessel, and get it back.
course that we can use <laughs> Docked with the Tholian ship. The good news is that my scans indicate the quantum phase inhibitor is on the bridge. All we need to do is go get it. The bad news is the Tholians know we're here. They're not going to give up without a fight. The Tholians come from an environment that is extremely hazardous to most humanoids. You and your team will need environmental suits to survive. Don't forget to equip and activate EV suits before you board the Tholian ship.
closer to the Taksu Thot. Stay alert. Opening a temporal portal to the 22nd century. Set a course for the Ryza system. Ryza, early 22nd century. Even the tourists won't be in this region for a few years yet. No one will be looking for the quantum phase inhibitor here. Not now, anyway. Let's try that cave up ahead. It looks like a good spot. Wow, rain on Ryza? I guess they haven't installed the weather control systems yet. We have to hide the device very well. I can't afford to let it fall into the wrong hands again. And the Vorgons are very persistent. No, that's too obvious. Anyone could find it there. That's better, but I still think it would be too easy to find. That's it. Someone will find it in a few hundred years, but that's a different story for a different captain. 
Let's get back to your time. We need to check on the Nakul. Setting course for 2014. We need to get back to the Nakul. Return the talks with tap. And we will let you live. Distress call. Do you require assistance? citizens as they freeze to death. You have done quite enough. Leave us alone. Time travelers and malcontents and tholians. The whole lot of you can fall into a black hole. Now go. We have to figure out how to save our people. And then we'll take steps to protect ourselves. Time is a weapon and it will never be turned against us again. This is Captain Benjamin Walker of the USS Postok. I'm responding to an emergency temporal transmission from these space-time coordinates, but we are no longer detecting the source of these transmissions. Did you lose a time traveler? I think you better come aboard while we resolve this. Prepare for transport. From these space-time coordinates, but we are no longer detecting the source of these transmissions. Did you lose a time traveler? I think you better... Greetings. It's nice to see you again. Not that you remember. We need to scan the continuum for Caldano. Would you care to assist me?
Were you able to locate Caldano? Enter the temporal coordinates into the transporter. What happened with Caldano? No, this was meant to happen. Caldano went further back into the past than you knew. The NX-01 Enterprise, captained by Jonathan Archer, found his ship in the 22nd century, and his chief engineer activated Caldano's emergency temporal circuit, which returned the ship to its last known time, this one. But by the time that happened, Caldano had been dead for centuries. The Tox Uthat is safe. It was found in the mid-24th century by Captain Jean-Luc Picard, who destroyed it before it could be used to harm others. Altering the past causes ripples. The effects move through time, shifting everything they touch, and it may take eons for all of them to be seen. The Nakul will survive, although their homeworld will be lost. They will become time travelers themselves, and their actions in the Temporal Cold War shape the galaxy you now know. There are some things you shouldn't change, that you can't change. You could check Captain Archer's old logs for more information, but you will know all about it soon enough. You are entering a dangerous era in history. Time travel like warp drive before it will radically change your society. I'll see you again. We have a lot to do. This is a sad day. We failed to save the Nakul system. And our friend from the future, Caldano, is dead. I know you did everything you could. Sometimes, especially when we venture into time travel, things must play out a certain way. So at least the timeline has been preserved. Captain Picard can now find the Tox Ulthot on Ryza in the 24th century. Still, let us mourn for Caldano and the Nakul people. <laughs>